welcome to our to my channel so today we are go we are going to learn how we can link the link the prime variety six data into power bi so we can link power bi by different data source if you want to get data you have by excel power bi symmetric model everything we can get it but we should link the power bi to the microsoft oracle database for this we need the bridge between them so for the bridge purpose we are going to use open database connection connectivity between them so we can do we can do by extracting the excel sheet also but it will be like manual process and difficult for us to get the real time data from the power bi power bi <coughs> from the prime bare physics so for that purpose i'm just going to teach you how we are going to link the data between them so first we need to download the uh, open database connectivity database mm, database mm, we need to have the odbc driver uh, yes you let in our pc so first we need to download it from our hmm, from the from any browser so i just click on this one so for download from that uh, particularly this christian christian home page so if you go there so i will just download the sq sq light odbc 64 bit i'll download it in my pc and i'll open it so it uh, this driver will act as the bridge between the uh, power bi and prime bare p6 so i'll install it okay it has been installed in my pc i'll click finish then i'll open it and i can see the csq late 3 so i'll just open the driver Wait. I don't know what is this okay it's not like this i'll click i'll click uh, odbc data source yeah this is the data source i'll just create the data source open the data source and it will come like this one administrative uh, data source like this interface so if you go to the system dmc you can see that it has been installed and it's 64 bit based on the requirement of the pc you can download uh, uh whichever suitable for you so if you if i go to the driver to check whether it's installed or not and you can see the sq lit light 3 odb server is installed okay so so if you go we have got everything for 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 us so now we'll go to user dsm and we'll add a new new sqlite database for us so i'll just install it and what you, you can write data source name any so i'll write new to this data uh, data source source and and we need the database name so we are going to use the prime bearer p6 so I'll, I'll just open in my previous video i have tell you the uh, the file location which we are going to use it so if you go here and we, if you use the database configuration and if you go to next existing here is the our database location so we have set our docker database of primary p6 in this pc in in this location similarly for you you can also get the database location from your primary p6 so i'll just close it and i'll come here and i will just paste it and i'll click on ok now you can see my database source from the pre6 so i'll cl cl click on ok and i'll close it after that after that we have done this one so we'll go to our um, power bi power bi desktop so we'll we'll get the we'll we'll click on the get data then after we'll go to the more and we'll click we are going to link it with by open database connectivity 
connectivity of Microsoft. So we'll search ODBC. After we search, we'll just click on this one. We have click. It will show this interface, and it will it will ask for the data source name. In DSM data source name, we have created our data source. So it so we have near this data source. If you click on this one, then we need to click OK. Then it will link to our data source of Prime Bear P6. So it will check whether it is you or no. So we need the username and password. So if we go to the username, we have the admin and we have created one, two, three, four, five. Any password we have created for it. So uh, how did you get this one? I have created my previous video where I have mention about everything about the configurations of it so i'll just show you how i did it so just if you click on if you go to the back if you add if you see we have already created a new connection so you need to go my previous video and see how i created the configuration for power uh, for prime bearer p6 okay so i will not in spend more time on it so so same password we are putting we are putting here and then if we connect it it will connect it to prime bearer it will open the p6 so same same i'm going to give in the odbc driver and if we click on connected it will connect it to it will connect to my prime bearer prime bearer p6 database so if it, it will see the list of the excel file in it so that's what we are looking for and we need to select whatever uh, excel file we need for for our process for furthermore or even more furthermore information about how we are going to create a dashboard for the prime bearer p6 file like subscribe and update and provide the comment on the on my youtube channel so i will be more, more motivated to provide you the more information of, over prime bearer p6 and power bi Thanks for watching my channel. Thank you so much for your patience and listening to me. Thank you.